Do you want to become a profitable trader? Hi, I am C. A. Rudramurthy, author, trader and trainer welcomes you to this pre-market report. Yes, yesterday FedMeet finally gave the same 75 basis point rate hike which was expected. However, the commentary from the Fed chairperson was definitely dovish and he said the future rate hikes are data dependent and he never entered any kind of what will be the next rate hike in the month of September. Market took the commentary and his 75 basis point rate hike which was already expected very very positive and today you are able to see even SGX Nifty indicating a 100 point gap up opening at around 16,750. Most important today is the monthly expiry which is very very crucial. It is easy to say that today market will be highly volatile because of monthly expiry and because of the Fed news which has already come in. But what is tough is to say what next in market and let me focus more about that. First of all, if you see the crude oil data, crude again is back to 107 to 108 dollar per barrel and it is again making a pullback after taking support at areas closer to 96, 97 dollar per barrel which I was hinting long back. Now, if crude starts inching back to again 115 to 120 dollar per barrel, and slowly even if dollar index starts moving up and rupee starts depreciating this market will be more healthy if you see some amount of profit booking or small correction. Let me tell you market will always move up in a big way when it has lots of shots and some positive news will drive the market on the upside with lot of short covering. Most important word here is short covering. So market makes a big up move when market is highly short and market starts making an up move and short starts covering and then it starts moving up, up and up. But if you see yesterday, the whole data is on the long side. That means everyone went into the Fed news hoping market to further go up and Fed news delivered as per market expectation now the question is from here that is after a 1200-1500 point kind of a move in nifty from here next to still see a further rally up in a very short span of time then who will buy this market because everyone are already on the long side. Now people start asking me is Rudra turning bearish definitely no I am only trying to say this is the zone where you have to book your trading longs. Whatever long positions you had taken on the trading side, use this gap up opening to book your profits. I see 16,800 to 16,850 to hold some level of resistance. If not, 17,000 to 17,050, the next resistance will hold firm. So the question now is for the last. 200 point up move in nifty in the entire span of around 1600 to 1800 point does the risk reward favor you to go long at current price is the big question what you have to keep in mind it is easy to say why market went up now see what has happened all that but what is tough to say is what next from here and that is what i am giving you clues that for the next 200 point up move does the risk reward favor you to go long or is it better to book profits now on your trading position and then allow fools to trade in and participate the last 200 point up move. And I always say profitable trading is all about probability and it is all about risk reward. If you ignore these two things then you will never make money in trading. And if you see July series uh, index has given a return of six and a half percent and bank nifty for July series is up close to eight to ten percent range. And let me tell you last month uh, and if you go three months prior to July 
and see the performance of monthly on index level it was down and I also hinted you and look at even my tweet I said July series will be positive because last three months markets have been giving negative return and July is not a month to go short and you have seen that happening because after today's expiry even if you measure July month has given a whopping return of over 6% at nifty level and over 8% at bank nifty level this is a big return undoubtedly at index level now again I am repeating it is now time to book profits and it is time to stay sidelines wait for a dip to come in market and then enter buy when there is blood in street and when everyone are saying market will collapse and sell when everyone are positive and they say market will move on top of the roof this is where intelligent and professional traders look at risk reward look at probability and then take positions it is also important to be specific on sectors and stocks for the next big move no doubt financials will outperform and support the market on the upside but you have to buy them at reasonable price and not at any price I'm sure all these inputs has added a lot of value to you to become a profitable trader. Thank you so much for watching. Signing off, Rudra Murthy.